Yo, mukbang, let's do this. All right, man, so it's been a while since I made a mukbang. It's been 12 days to be exact. So, man, today we've got food that is considered quite luxury, I suppose, in prison, slash jail, whatever you want to call it, man. I don't know if they actually serve Coca-Cola in jail. I don't know if you can request that, but fuck it. Your boy got it nonetheless. So, I right, man, so today I got a spring roll, vegetarian mess of spring roll. Not the biggest fan of this one, but yet again, when you're in prison, you don't get to choose, I suppose. Yeah, if you've ever been to prison, let me know by the way what it's like. Got some noodles, man. We all know noodles are the best thing to eat in this world, regardless if you're rich or poor. Everyone eats them because they're delicious, they're cheap, and they're great, man. Got an egg on some Turkish bread, by the way. Got a massive two liter Coca Cola bottle that I had left over, so let's do this. God damn it, spider man. What the hell is a spider doing in my room? God damn it to me. We got Bob in the background, by the way. Bob just thought, you know, hey, I'm gonna be back in the video. I don't know what he's doing, but anyways, man. I don't actually know if they eat this in jail. I just figured out it'd be awesome to put it in the video. So, let's do this. Got my spork, by the way, which is something they use in jail. Mm. Now it's good. The last time I had this, it was horrible. It was sort of like salt on it. Mm. Man, oh man, I had a bad day today. I'm not even gonna lie, man. As y'all may or may not know, I got arrested a couple of days ago for driving without a license illegally. And, um,. My driver's instructors know about it. I mean, they were mad. They actually were very chill. I mean, I know that they're very chill in general. I know them. I know them in person as well. Um, that's a nice AMG in the background, isn't it? Mm, no, that's the Ferrari, I think. But anyways, they were mad. They were like, ain't smart, man. Because the next time it happens, we are going to tell the CBR, which is like the place that you pay a lot of money for when you want to drive off. I mean, it's a money-making machine. It's ridiculous. But anyways, um, that you have been driving illegal for the second time. Mm. Mm. And um, then you're not allowed to drive anymore for five or eight years. So yeah. Trust me, your boys learned the lesson, man. I got caught. And... Uh, I'm actually in the system of the police, which is the most messed up part, which is really fucked up. I'm in the system, so if I get put over again for something that breaks the law, then I'm screwed. Then I won't get a fine, then I'll go to court. Bam. Straight away. Put in jail. So I gotta be very careful, man. I really have to be careful, man. I can't destroy everything that I've built up, man. Hmm. Now regardless, man, we got some good food here. Let me break this egg. Actually, I haven't really eaten any eggs in a while. Uh, I've actually been eating more vegan than vegetarian, man. Wow. Oh, this is good. Mm. That yeah, Turkish bread. I think it's called um, a pie. Or pride or something? One of the two. No, pie. And it's good, man. Mmm. I'm chill though, don't get me wrong. No. Hey, regardless, man. I just finished watching Breaking Bad. I mean, I think it's the second time or third time I've watched Breaking Bad. I mean, isn't it like, though, once in a while you get to watch like an all ass fucking program or, or movie? And just the nostalgia of it is just amazing. Same with like toys or video games. The nostalgia is just awesome. Even though you know the ending, it's just still good to play or watch. The same with Breaking Bad, man. I watched it. Five seasons and sixteen episodes. Hey man, it is the, the the last season is like I think one of the maybe one of the best seasons. 
Yeah, because in the beginning you get to find out who they are, this and that, blah, blah, blah. Eventually you get to find out spoilers, by the way, if you don't want to watch this, don't click. You find out this guy, Walter White, who's a chemistry teacher. He gets cancer, but financially they can't afford it, so he, he, he makes some blue. And he builds a massive empire that falls up, falls down, gets this. I mean, it's awesome. You've got to check it out if you haven't watched it. If you've never watched or heard of Breaking Bad, what have you been doing with your life? I mean, come on, let's be honest. If you, if you don't know what it is, come on. I want to bet 20 bucks that they don't actually serve this in jail. Because, like I said... I think this is considered quite luxury food in jail, right? If, if I'm r right or wrong. I haven't done research on it, but... You know, you guys always correct me or tell me stuff in the comments. Mm. It's really difficult eating this, man. God damn, this spot is annoying. It's, it's, shit, it's a shit design, man. I don't like it. But when you're in prison, you can't ask. You get what you receive. That's the thing. Yeah, it's been a while, man. I'm sorry. Fuck. I, I haven't uploaded a mukbang in 12 days. I, I, it's bad, I know. It's just I thought I'd um, do a house tour last week. Because uh, it's been a while, so I also made a little vlog, you know what I mean? So yeah, it's still going to be a bit of vlogging once in a while. Mm. You know what I like about these noodles? I got these at, the local, at my local Turkish shop. And they're the only ones that I can find... Um, Actually, look, you know the thing as a vegetarian, you got to be very careful what you pick, even noodle-wise. Even when it goes to chips. If I go to the store and I think, hey, let me get a bag of Lay's. Okay, I have to watch the ingredients because, you know, like barbecue taste. I don't know if the meat, if it's a synthetic meat flavor or like actual meat in it. And that's the most fucked up part, I think. Or the most confusing, let me keep it like that. Because it's the same with noodles. you got shrimp noodles, beef noodles, and chicken noodles. Some noodles have real pieces of beef and chicken in it, however these ones are like, like, I don't know, um, $35 cents a, p a pack, this is the only one that I actually am sure of that is vegetarian, fully vegetarian, because the other ones have chicken or beef or shrimp flavor, now with flavor, I don't know if they mean it's actual beef in it, so actual beef from the cow, or if it's synthetic beef, so it's made from milk and fake beef, you know what I mean? For me, it's very confusing because I don't know if it is. I mean, you know, it's very, for me, it's very confusing. So that's why I just took this. And then the, the one, the reason why I like this one the most, especially, it's got a nice, it's not spicy, it's very mild. But it has this nice lime or lemon flavor, which it, it makes it perfect. It's just such a little sm small touch of lime, but it does the job. Hmm. And this thing, this thing sucks. It really does. Why am I being difficult? This is how you're supposed to eat it, actually. I forgot. This is how you're supposed to eat noodles. Mm. 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 Won't even be eating this anymore. I don't want it. This is the best. The noodles are the best. Um, yeah. I know in jail as well, they've got like black coffee in there, but I don't drink coffee. Nor do I like coffee, and coffee does weird things to me. Mm.
Mm. Mm. Let me show you the install of this uh, spring roll. This is called a lumpia, by the way. Yeah. My camera would focus. Yeah, there you go. So this is the inside of it. I mean, normally there would be like meat in it, so pork, chicken, fuck it, whatever you think, shrimp, lamb, the weirdest things. Uh, but, you know, as a vegetarian, this is a very, very nice option. I actually think this is even vegan, if I'm not mistaken. But I mean, just have a closer look. Got really nice vegetable. I mean, it's a good, it's a good idea. Uh, it's just, however, it's much more better and more authentic if you actually have someone that's from Asia makes you this stuff. Um... Talking about them, we actually have a neighbor across the road who makes them the best spring rolls, vegetarians, and um, I actually, she actually makes and sells, sells them as well, so I might buy one. I can buy some couple of spring rolls this week or next week, because her stuff hits like good, man. Like, her stuff is the bomb, you know what I mean? But yeah, I've still, but nonetheless, fuck it, let's talk about something else, man. I've had people hitting me up on my DM saying, hey man, are you still going to school? Nah, man, I'm fucking done with that. Let me keep it real. Um, school started for the most people in general uh, on the 1st of September. However, this year, um, I want to, I need a break. Fuck it, man. I need to rearrange things in my life. I need to sort stuff. Uh, I need to still think what I really want to do. And not just take a random thing and they're not liking it after all and spending money on it. Because fuck it, these things aren't for free, man. You gotta pay for these education things. You know what I mean? Because nothing is for free, so, um, I mean, fuck, I, I just haven't found something yet. And before I actually do find something, I, I want to do volunteer work as well first, to actually gain experience in the outside world, because I'm a YouTuber, so, I mean, just saying that, just because I'm a YouTuber doesn't make me antisocial, but fuck it, in my, my position it does. I don't like people, I don't fuck with people, keep it real, I don't like people, I'm not bothered to talk to people. I may not have a lot of friends, but fuck, am I happy without a lot of friends? I'm not gonna lie, once in a while I do get a bit like, damn, I wanna hang out, but ah, fuck it. Friends are just friends. They're nothing more, they don't do anything more for you in general, man. Uh, there's no one I actually call my brother except my own actual brother, because he's my brother. What do you mean? We've been through shit and stuff. Or well, we've been there for each other, or we support each other. And it's difficult finding a real friend this time, and it doesn't switch up for you for a girl or someone else. Gotta be close, man. You mean keep your enemies close and your friends far. That's what I. That's what people say in general. That's not what I say. That's what people say in general. Keep it fucking, man. Keep a circle small. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna end this video, man. Nonetheless, I've spoken enough. I hope y'all enjoy this video, nonetheless, man. Um, yeah, like I said, man. I know it's been almost two weeks since I made my last mug bang, but I've been thinking of some ideas as well, some new concepts for this channel. But I'm gonna end this. If you haven't checked out yesterday's ASMR. I go and give it a hit, man. It's cool, and I'll see you next time. Peace out, virgins. Peace out.